Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Paul Yu Jr. And in today's video, I wanted to uh, make an update about a free, a better free screen recorder. So if that's really all you're looking to do is, is have a screen recorder to <laughs> obviously record what you're doing on your screen, this is your best option to do it for free that I've seen so far. Now, Zoom has a ton of other features. Uh, we actually use it when we are recording our podcast as well. So, and I apologize in advance if the audio is a little off just because I am using my laptop's microphone, but I wanted to do this while I was in the mood. <laughs> so anyway, uh, I'll put a link in the description. The website is simple, uh, zoom.us. And the only thing you have to do is create an account, which takes two seconds. Not literally, but so uh, so you go to sign up and it says comma, it's free. And it says your work email address. Just use whatever email address you want. You can use Google or Facebook, whatever. <clears throat> and after that, you will download Zoom and we're going to go right to that. So we see Zoom right here. And let's open her up and let's go to new meeting. Just click on that. Oh, hey, yo. So now I don't want my face in here. So what I'm going to do is hit stop video. And <clears throat> to keep this as simple as possible, what we're going to do is just start off by hitting record. So uh, like I said, right now I'm using a different screen recorder so that we can do this. So I don't know if this is actually going to affect anything unless it record, but hey, let's find out. So let's go to, um, let's hit record and let's go to share. Okay. And it's literally right here, share screen. That's it. So you can share different windows and so forth. You do share your screen. Now we're on the screen. And this stuff up here shouldn't come up uh, at all. And then anything that you do from here should just, you know, it, it should just be recording all the way through. And yeah, my Roomba loves to go off at the right time. But anyway, so uh, yeah, so we go to youtube.com slash polio junior DIY, which is obviously my main, my main channel and hopefully it's uh recording everything right now um make sure you check out my official podcast <laughs> as well on youtube so the inner circle podcast but let's play something real quick just to see if it comes up here to start the hopefully. video i just wanted to give uh, you know everybody a, a heads so up what we're going to do what we're going to go back uh, attempting to do here do, 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 do. so we're going to hit stop share now everything's still recording at the moment, so anything you do will show up in here. Go to share. Now if you want to share sound, you always have to select this share computer sound. You know, not just your microphone, this is for um, just anything that's playing on the computer. Share, okay, and now do this. So I'm trying to play. Ba, 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 ba. There were aliens, I think okay. that's a full. This was our first episode of the Inner Circle Podcast. Uh, let's close this out and quit Opera. And just so you know, while you are in Zoom, you can also invite people in here. And as you, if you have seen my podcast, you can also have um, what you would call. So let's hit stop share. Now, if I hit start video, you see my my grin right now, and the webcam is really. I mean, the webcam is just terrible because it's the uh, <clears throat> it's the one used for on the actual laptop itself. So you can uh, you can invite people hitting invite, and then you can just you can actually send them a URL, or you can open up one of your whatever email um, platform that you do use, and send them an invitation, and they will come in, and then the screen will actually be split. So from there. You can record yourself and the other person talking as well. But so you have a bunch of different options as far as stop this video. So we're still recording in general. 
So you have all the all these options to share whatever you can share. Like I said, a window that's open if you want to have a whiteboard that's open, and one of the cool th and if you have an extra webcam too, content from second camera, you can do that as well. Now I don't have one, but so so nothing's gonna come up. <laughs> And there are also more options as far as, uh, let's go to advanced sharing options, or where is it, where is it? Um, because you can, um, you can actually, sh if you have a green screen, it's pretty cool. Okay, so it is actually in video settings. Ah, we can let that run, whatever. Uh, so let's hit video again. Like I said, I'm using the laptop webcam, so it's not that great. <clears throat> and none of this will show up in when you're using Zoom. So you see like the mute, stop video, invite, manage participants. None of that will be in the video whatsoever. It's only going to be what you're sharing and you know what you're recording. <clears throat> so from here, we are going to go to uh, video. We hit this up arrow. And so you can always change your camera. You can change your microphone and all that good stuff. <coughs> Excuse me. And the other cool thing too is you can also record uh, from your phone as well. But I think you have to have uh, the Zoom app on your phone to do that. But anyway, uh, so you can actually select, you can go to video settings and they will show you a bunch of different options. These are the ones, I just keep everything how they put it. So enable HD, uh, enable hardware acceleration, touch up my appearance, all that good stuff. And then one cool thing is the actual, the virtual background. Now, if you do have a green screen, this would work uh, absolutely fantastic. So you could select one of these, obviously, you know, <laughs> I don't have a green screen, so it's, uh, I'm not going, it's not gonna show up the way that it should. And then you can also add images that you wanna have in your background while you're recording as well, which is pretty cool. So if I unselect this, I may not even have the right equipment. Yeah, computer doesn't meet requirements. So if you have a relatively newer computer, you can actually uh, deselect that and the program will do its best to actually have these as your backgrounds. So, and where it actually looks legitimate, so. But yeah, as far as anything else, this is, is very simple. And you, you do not need to upgrade to Pro to do this and so forth. So, but that's just, the, the sharing the screen option is just one of the, one of the, you know, simplest things that Zoom has to offer. But you can venture through this program and find a ton of stuff that they have available, which is really cool. So, like I said, I use it for my podcast, and so where we are sharing different videos, um, we are sharing website URLs and all that kind of stuff. So, uh, just a, for instance, really quick, I'm going to open up Opera, and do do do. Okay, and so I'm going to click share, and go to basic, and then. You know, I, I would typically always have this selected, share computer sound. Make sure that's selected so anything you're playing in the web browser is being played. And then uh, share. And now all of this will come up while you are recording. Like I said, nothing up here will be shown. Nothing up here. So mute, stop video, annotate, none of that will come up. So. Now let's just uh, let's just click play. Make sure that it does actually play through. Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Polio Junior. Okay. And before we actually start the video, I just want so to give everybody so, a and it'll actually heads up on what I am attempting. It's not going to record through the microphone when you are. Um, what you call? It it will not record through the microphone when you're playing a video. It'll record through the system. So. Now I, I click stop record. Now what we do is close this out and meeting for all. Let's close out Opera. And what you're gonna have is this little option here. And what this is doing is it's obvious it's encoding <clears throat> your video. So, and what you're gonna have are two 
separate files. So one of the files is going to be the, you know, the, the video file that you wanted to record and so forth. And then the other one will be simply an audio file. So what I'm going to do is pause this and let this run and then I'll show you what it looks like when it comes up. Okay, so we are back in. So this is what happened is this folder popped up showing us that we have our Zoom uh, video and then we also have just the audio only. So let's open this up. Let's see how it plays with with ice cream yeah. screen recorder. Let's go to share. Okay. And I think all these options to share. You have a green screen. Think is that you want to have in your back. But yeah, as far as anything else, this is so everything does actually work. Now I should not use Windows Media Player. I should always use VLC yeah. Player. Let's go to share. But okay. yeah, so you're gonna have four. You're gonna have two videos. Uh, you're gonna, I you're gonna have two files basically. Pro. You're gonna have an audio and you're and gonna have a video be shown. So nothing up here. You can obviously see that so the screen here. Stop video, annotate, nothing. Now let's just... And before we actually start the video, I just wanted to give everybody a heads up on what I am uh, attempting. It's not gonna record through the microphone okay. when you are... So on um, what I am uh, attempting. Okay. So it actually is so everything's good. The microphone when you now are, you can actually choose not to show uh, your uh, if as you could see my uh, it was recording my with my webcam on the top right hand corner yeah. as well. If you have a row so, but that's just when once we were sharing something. So. Yeah, so yeah, let's go back. Nothing up here. So you can actually so disable that so that the end show up. Yeah. None but of that will record everything as so, far as... Um, hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Paulio Jr. And before we actually start the video, I just want to get everybody in the right now. But everything works perfectly fine. Rename it however you want. And then, you know, test, whatever. And then you can upload it. And But if you do want to use a video editor, uh, I strongly, I strongly suggest using VSDC uh, free video editor. So that is one of, uh, it's one of the easiest, easiest free video editors to use. So, but yeah, very simple. Uh, definitely check out Zoom. It has a ton of bonus features on it. Let's get out of here. It's got a, it has so many features on it. I'm just going to delete what we did there, but. <clears throat> There's so many more features that are available in Zoom itself. And so if you actually do invite somebody, then you will, um, so that, then that's when you get limited to only, if you invite more than one person, then you're limited to 40 minutes of uh, recording time uh, using the free version. But if you just invite one person, you can do it well over 40 minutes or so. But yeah, if you have any questions about Zoom, I would love to answer them. It's the one of the best programs that I've found in general as far as what it is capable of. And there's probably a ton of things that I haven't even found out yet. So, but that's all I have for today. Uh, Zoom.us links are in the description. Thank you very much for everybody who has subscribed. Turn on notifications and be sure to check out the Inner Circle podcast, which is the podcast that I do with my cousin at least once a week uh, on YouTube and it is available on uh, Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, anywhere you get podcasts basically. So, and that's about it. So check out Zoom and I hope it helps uh, just one person. So, all right guys, see you in the next one. Bye.